Hello everyone, now let us see the medical terminology of urinary system. Now coming to the urinary specific suffixes and prefixes. The term anti indicates before, cyst indicates bladder or sac, diali indicates dialysis, noct indicates night, olig indicates few or little as in the case oliguria, poly indicates much or many as in the case polyuria, pile indicates pelvis or kidney relating to pelvis or kidney, REN, reno or REN indicates kidneys, tripsy indicates crushing as in lithotripsy, urea indicates a condition that is related to urine, urine condition and ureter indicates ureters. Now coming to some of the diseases and conditions of the urinary system. First one, anurea indicates, an means without, urea means relating to urine. So anurea is absence of urine. Next is diuresis. Diuresis is an increase in the volume of urine. Dysuria, dis means bad or painful. And dysuria is a painful urination. Enuresis, enuresis is Involuntary nocturnal urination. Remember, enuresis is involuntary nocturnal urination. Frequency, urinary frequency, as in the case, urinary frequency. Frequency is when the patient voids more frequently than what is usually than what is usual for the patient. The next is glomerulonephritis. Glomerulo is pertaining to glomerulus. Nephritis is nothing but inflammation of the kidney. Glomerulonephritis is the inflammation of the glomerulus of the kidney. The next term is glycosuria. Glyco means sugar. Urea means possessing urine. Glycosuria is the abnormal presence of glucose in urine. The next is hematuria. Hemat means pertaining to blood. Urea means possessing urine. So hematuria is blood in the urine. Hesitancy, urinary hesitancy, commonly called as urinary hesitancy. Hesitancy is the difficulty to initiate urination. Next is incontinence. In means lack of. Continence means ability of control. control. Ability to control the bladder or bowel functions. And incontinence is the inability of control urination or defecation. In case of incontinence, the patient might not be able to control the bladder or bowel functions, in other words. The next term is nephrolithiasis. Nephro means pertaining to kidney. Lithiasis means presence or formation of stones. And nephrolithiasis is a condition of having renal calliculi. Calliculi is nothing but stone. Renal calliculi or stones in the kidneys. The next term is nocturia. Noct means night. Urea means possessing urine. Nocturia is excessive urination at night. Next term is oliguria. Oligo means few or little. So oliguria is a decrease in the formation or passing of urine. Whereas contrast to that polyuria, poly means many. Polyuria is the passing of an abnormally large amount of urine. The next term is proteinuria. Protein is a complex nitrogenous compounds. Proteinuria is nothing but presence of abnormally large amount of protein in the urine. Pyluria. Pyluria is the presence of an abnormal amount of white blood cells in the urine. Pyluria is nothing but abnormal presence of abnormal amounts of white blood cells in the urine. The next is renal calculus. Renal means pertaining to kidney. Calculus is a stone formed by the accumulation of mineral salts. So renal calculus is stone occurring in the urinary tract. The next is renal failure. Renal failure is the inability of the kidneys to concentrate urine or excrete waste. The next is uremia. Uremia is the presence of large amount of urea in the blood. It is also called as azotemia. Uremia is presence of large amounts of urea in the blood. Urea is a compound containing urea. It is a waste product from met protein metabolism. Urea is a waste product from the protein metabolism. The next term is urinary retention. Retention is the resistance to movement. 
so urinary retention is the inability of the patient to empty their bladder urinary retention is inability of the patient to empty their bladder and finally urinary tract infection it is a infection of any of the structures of the urinary tract urinary tract usually it involves organs that are that help in the secretion and elimination of urine so urinary tract inf infection is infection of any of the structures of the urinary tract and finally coming to urgency commonly called as urinary urgency urinary urgency is an intense desire to urinate immediately these are some of the diseases and conditions that are pertaining to urinary system thank you for watching please subscribe for further videos on medical coding and cpc training